Okay, morning guys, check it out. I don't know if it's just, we got some fish. This is my latest batch of catfish. They've done really well. Really, really well. Got these from a different supplier. And uh, 500 fish have lost less than 10. I don't know if you can see it or not. There's a skull in there jumping around. That's either 9 or 10. The plan today is to take a couple out and have a measure. We'll measure the average one. Maybe take a look at a little one. Some don't grow. That's not unusual. And there's one giant one. He is huge. He is huge. Probably double the length and four or five times the weight of the average. You see him? He's massive. I'm going to dip him up here. Take a couple of measurements. Okay, we start with the little one. Probably six inches or so. Just a, a wee little guy. Forgot to make my tube wet. Turn around, turn around. There, no, there you go. Hey, 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 hey. Uh, seven. Yeah, right around seven inches. That's a small one. I will go average. Whoa, don't fall in the tilapia tank. <laughs> there he goes. Nice fish. Twelve and a half. Yeah, pushing thirteen actually. Beautiful fish. That's ready to harvest for sure. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Other than dirty from falling on the ground, not a mark on them, yeah? Beautiful, beautiful fish. Now let's take a look at the big one. Here's a skull. When they eat the fish, they never eat this part. They eat everything else. Sometimes you get the, the, the spiny fin bone. It comes out the side of the head right here. Find those sometimes, but not normally. This is... Uh, Good fish, 12 plus inches for sure. Check him out. Check him out, he's a river monster, this one. Same age as the six inch, seven inch fish, you know? When I got these, after about two weeks, I noticed one fish was quite a bit bigger as in at least double the size and he's been doubling in size ever since let's see if we can get it he won't fit in the pipe I know that I'm thinking 20 inches or so oh he's bigger a 24 inch fish like this weighs about two kilos we know that there he is whoa Hard to tell. 22 inches is what I'm getting here. Oh gee, no way, look at that. Can you see that? 23. 23 inches. He's as big as uh, the three and a half year old fish I have. I don't know what he is, three or four months. Freak of nature. And all I've been told oh, thousands of times on these catfish videos, that the big fish will eat the small fish. You would think this guy would have eaten all those fish. And all of these fish are in tiny tank, 1200 liter tank, that's what it is. And they're gonna be in that tank their entire life. I'm not separating them. I've tried that. Look at that beauty. This don't hurt him at all. He's an air breathing fish. He's not doing no damage to him. As long as he stays wet, he's fine. These guys can stay out of water a lot longer than snakehead can. Look at that guy, huh? Look at him. Beauty! Don't go in the tilapia tank, you will eat them. <laughs> they don't seem to eat their own unless their own is sick or dying. 
I know I'm no catfish expert, but been doing this quite a few years now. Raised them, raised a lot of fish, thousands, thousands and thousands of fish, and that's my observation. They'll only eat sick and dying fish. He's a little bit lean. Let's see, boy or girl? Now, come on, tell us the truth now. It's a boy. I think. Yeah, I There's his boy parts right there. You see that? Look at him. Beautiful. You want to see catfish teeth? He's got an overbite. You see that? Their teeth are not razor sharp. They're more for grinding, I think. But there's plenty of them, and they don't hurt when they bite you. I've been told that these are deadly poison, and if you get stung with them, these spikes here, you get stung with them, you got to go to the emergency, and it's not true. <laughs> I've been spiked hundreds of times. It don't feel nice, but it doesn't require a trip to the doctor. Back in the drink. Some water for them. This is water straight out of the tilapia tank. I use my water multiple times. Every couple of days I uh, change the water in the tilapia tank and I give it to the catfish. And then from this tank it goes to a different catfish tank that has a filter on it. This one don't have a filter. And uh, from there it goes to the garden. So this is originally rainwater that gets used four times. That's pretty cool. I got out on beauty fish. I will be harvesting uh, at least half of these the next time I do a water change. A couple of days probably. I don't have time today. We just have some fun watching jump. They will try and jump the wall. Have you ever seen 500 fish have breakfast? It's a little splashy. <laughs> And it don't take long. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, that's it. Cool catfish video. I think. At least there's a big catfish anyway. And a small one. And some in the middle. All right, guys. As always, thanks for watching.